Season of the Worthy is here, and with it comes a bunch of brand new random rolled weapons. So in this video, we're going to go over one of the weapons, the Dire Promise. Dire Promise is a hand cannon uh, back when faction rallies was a thing in the game, and a lot of people really enjoyed this hand cannon, specifically for PvP. So in this video, we're going to go over what the god roll is going to be for PvE, as well as PvP, and let you guys in on what my god roll is, is going to be. Let's get started. Hey, what is up guys? Spear Gaming here, back with another Destiny 2 God Roll Guide. And if you guys are interested in knowing what the best rolls on all the brand new weapons in Season of the Worthy, be sure to click subscribe and turn on the notification bell so you never miss an upload. We're going to be breaking down all the brand new weapons and their best rolls you can get. Alright, so first up we have Dire Promise, a kinetic 150 RPM hand cannon. This does drop from the World Pool legendary engrams. So any of the engrams you get from Prime engrams or just regular legendary engrams, you can get the Dire Promise to drop. If you have legendary shards to spend, you can go to Master Raul at the tower and you can buy legendary engrams from him. This is going to be a really easy way to try to farm for this weapon, but it does get a little bit pricey if you're limited on the shards that you have. Let's go ahead and take a look at the stats real quick. Impact is 80, range is 45, 50 stability, 61 handling, 54 reload speed, 150 RPM, 11 in the mag. And for the hidden stats, we have 87 aim assist, 60 inventory size, 14 zoom 84 recoil and 16 bounce intensity bounce direction tens vertical all right so we're going to break down what the best perks combinations you can get for this weapon for pve and pvp and of course we're going to start with the third and the fourth column perks as those are typically the perks most people will go for when it comes to the god roll the magazine perks and the sights do matter uh, but the main bulk of it is going to be your third and fourth perk slot. Alright, so taking a look at the third perk slot here for Dire Promise, you can actually roll either triple tap, opening shot, auto loading holster, snapshot, or overflow. If you're looking for a PvE roll, I think your best perks here are either going to be overflow or triple tap. And if you're looking for a PvP roll, you definitely want to try to get either opening shot or snapshot. Those I think are going to be pretty cut and dry as far as PvE versus PvP in the first slot. Now moving on to the second slot, you got a few different options here. For PvE, Swashbuckler is going to be pretty good, as well as Osmosis. I think those are probably going to be your best bets when it comes to PvE. Now for PvP, uh, you definitely want to go for Rangefinder if you can manage to get it, but also Swashbuckler could be pretty good for PvP. Alright, so next up we're going to go ahead and look at the sights for Dire Promise. You can get Fast Draw, Steady Hand, True Sight, Hit Mark, Crossfire, or Sure Shot. Now, of course, me being on console, uh, based off of recent changes to hand cannons, we found out that stability is actually more important on console than ranges. Range actually does matter. It does help as well. But the main thing you want to stack up for would be stability. So knowing that and being on console, uh, that's going to change up which site you actually want to use uh, compared to previous seasons. Now when it comes to the sites for Dire Promise, there's three sites of these six that actually stick out. The first being Steady Hand, which gives you plus 10 handling, plus 10 stability, and plus 5 aim assist. The next one after that would probably be True Sight, which gives you plus 3 range, plus 3 handling, plus 3 stability, and plus 3 aim assist. And if you don't get either of those, you want to try to get Fast Draw, which does give you plus 15 handling, plus 5 stability, and plus 5 aim assist. The other sites either give you negative stability or uh, they don't add any stability. And so I think uh, those three that I mentioned, Fast Draw, Steady Hand, and True Sight are going to be your best picks. All right, now moving on to the magazine perks. There are quite a few options here, but I think some of them are uh, clear options that you should go for over some of the others. Now, in regards to Dire Promise, uh, there's a clear winner here in my opinion, and that would be Ricochet Rounds. Gives you plus 5 range and plus 10 stability. This is going to be good in PvE and PvP. Now, if you can't get Ricochet Rounds, some other good options I think would be Flared Magwell, which gives you plus 5 stability, plus 15 reload speed. And also, uh, if you can't get that, Light Mag is going to give you plus 5 range and plus 10 reload speed. Uh, so again, it, being on console with a hand cannon, you want to maximize your stability as much as you can, but range does not hurt either. 
so again, Ricochet Rounds is number one pick. And then uh, under that would probably be Flared Magwell or Light Mag. All right, so now that we went over the best perk combinations you can get for PvE and for PvP, what is my god roll? So, of course, I'll be going for a PvP Dire Promise. And the god roll that I'm going to be chasing this season is as follows. For my site, I'm really going to be searching for Steady Hand. For the Magazine perk, definitely Ricochet Rounds. And for the first slot perk... We have opening shot and the second slot perk, we're going to go with rangefinder. That's going to be my god roll for the dire promise that I'll be chasing this season. So let me know in the comments section your guys' god roll or the best one you've gotten so far. And that way we can kind of compare to see uh, which one's better. Or if you have any other ideas of perks that you really enjoy in this gun, I'd love to hear it in the comments section down below. But that's going to be it from me, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I just wanted to make a quick guide on what the best roll for dire promises so you guys can get to grinding thank you so much for watching if you did enjoy this video do me a favor smash that like button subscribe if you're new turn on notifications and i will see you guys in the next one thanks for watching